Hello, it's Frank from FNL Superstore, and I'm doing a quick how-to on how to update your uh, AmLogic AML 8726MX or M6 or whatever you want to call it tablet with CyanogenMod 2. This is specifically for uh, the Inol tablet line and also the Zenithink tablet line. There might be some other comp zips uh, that Christian has made. You'd have to to follow the, the thread at Dragon Devs or SlateJoy.com. Just kind of Google uh, CyanogenMod 10.2 for Inol, Zenithink, uh, Zenithink, AML 8726MX. Uh, and that pretty much covers, you know, all the line, the Crystal, Crystal Hero, Fire, Elf, Aurora 2, uh, C97, C93, C93, 2F, uh, and then whatever these media comm, I, I have no clue, but uh, it, it's a very popular modification uh, for the AmLogic tablets. We've been doing it for years, so I wanted to kind of do an install tutorial. I've just been very busy. Basically, what I do for my customers is I put together file packages. Uh, the file packages for the Zenith thing include this folder right here, ZT update. This is very important. These files need to be on the root. When I say the root, the base, the the bottom on the mic on a uh, micro SD card. And, and to do that, you can. And the easiest way to do it is to open the package I give you. Uh, I'm going to give you a download link for it. Just double click it, and then you'll get to this window right here. If you have 7-zip, you might it might be different. I guess if you're using just the the stock WinZip that comes or um, not not even WinZip, the stock stock uh, archiver that comes with uh, Windows. You can also uh, unzip these files to your hard drive and then drag and drop them from your hard drive. But you get the point here. There's going to be anywhere between four and five files. You want to drag these files over here to your uh, micro SD card. Uh, and then as those copy over, I'm going to explain to you about the Inal line of tablets. The Inal tablets have this file, U image underscore recovery. This is another file that has to be on the root part of your micro SD card or else it will not boot into TWRP properly and you won't be able to uh, you won't be able to update your tablet. Uh, I think that's really about it. Again, if you are my customer, I give you these packages and this is the reason why I'm doing it this way is to explain how to install them. So we're going to be doing this for a C97 as you can see here I've got I've got the uh, the files numbered. You really don't have to worry about what they do. Just understand that you install them in this order and it works. So you got everything on your micro SD card. You pop your micro SD card out. Put it in your C97. On the C97 to get into recovery is plus and power. On all the Inal tablets it's volume minus and power. On the C93 it's uh it's back in power. A little fingerprint right there. Or no, maybe it's the ceiling. I don't know. Oh no, it's a fingerprint. Made it worse. <clears throat> Team Win, this is basically this is basically the, the people that uh, developed this touch interface. Uh, you'd want to do a white. Advanced white EMMC is always good. That's basically the internal drive. I'm trying to not get my big head in this video because I don't want to take up the whole screen. So once you go back, as you see, I'm back here. I went to this, the regular part here in the factory reset wipes data cache and Delvic. Just go ahead and do that. Swipe factory reset. Let me go home, install, click one, add more zips, click two, add more zips, click three, add more zips, click four, I'm getting ahead of myself, and then swipe to confirm. Now you could just sit it, sit the tablet down and let it do its magic. Um, not all packages are going to have four, some will have three as you can see right here. This is the hero package, this has three because the hero has a multi-user uh, um, file system that's that's the way it's uh, laid out um, and and some have five it all depends sometimes I uh, preload sometimes I give a file that preloads um, flash what else flash Netflix crackle 
and some other uh, there's one more oh Hulu a version of Hulu that'll work on any tablets so that's pretty much it um, I guess I could sit here and show you that the tablet is just pretty much installing after this is done it's gonna it's gonna ask you to swipe to unlock it and then reboot the system just reboot the system it should boot fine uh, if it doesn't you might have to do it again I guess you might have a corrupt file you might want to check the integrity of the files that you downloaded just in case if you have a dirty connection at your house I want dirty that sounded dirty anyways uh, I hope that that's the easiest five minutes you've listened to bye